Yo, what's good, YouTube? Um, I know this isn't my usual video, but I still feel like I need to speak on this because I know I'm probably not the only one who is going through what I'm going through right now. But do not let life overwhelm you. Don't do it. It's going to try, but you cannot let life overwhelm you. Life tries to add so many things to your schedule at once with a heads up or not and you kind of just have to know how to maneuver through that you know um and you have to know how to manage all that no matter what you already have going on life just throws stuff at you whether that be work schoolwork meetings appointments anything it can throw anything at you man and um you just kind of have to know how to roll with the punches you know you gotta know how to do it and what sucks about being overwhelmed is that you don't always feel overwhelmed for a little bit. Some people feel overwhelmed for days. I can only imagine that. Two months ago, you could have like asked me about that. I'll be like, really? I feel like if you're overwhelmed for like more than two days, you're being extra. But nah, man, it starts to really get to you out there. Well, depending on what you have going on. It's like it creeps up on you. It's like it's always there depending on what's going on. You know, it it, it comes like like this. It comes like really freaking fast. It's like, man, it hits you like a freaking truck sometimes, man. Like there's been days where I genuinely struggle to get out of my bed because I just know how much is going on. And I'm just like, I just don't know if I can do it for another day. Which brings me to my first point, honestly. Please find some time or a hobby or something to keep you going. You can't just always be working, always be stressed about life, bills, whatever the case may be, relationships, friendships, catching up on schoolwork. You can't always be stressed. You got to find a time to not think about it. If you if you are always thinking about it, it's going to consume you. You can't you can't do that. You got to find an outlet of some sort, whether that be reading a sport you play, playing games, talking to people, talking to your friends, talking to God, reading your Bible, um, anything, man, eating good food, going out with friends. You know, you got to find some sort of outlet to really, you know, let yourself breathe for a second to stop thinking about your struggles. And although it may not be a permanent solution, it's going to help tremendously to help you get through your situation at the moment you know um having those experiences and letting yourself not think about everything you got going on is very helpful and it helps you to refresh your mind and keep you going uh which brings me to my second point don't always be thinking about what you have going on you know and I know it sounds wow, amazing. Don't if you're feeling overwhelmed, just don't be overwhelmed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. It sounds very um, you know, straightforward and very easy. Uh, easier said than done. But um it's one of the best things you can do for yourself. How I like to think about it is don't worry about next year. Don't worry about next month. Don't worry about next week. Don't worry about tomorrow. Don't worry about the next twelve hours. The next hour the next 15 minutes the next minute be here and now here and now don't think about what's going on in the future don't stress about it don't think about it you had, when you get there you can worry about it but until you get there be in the present enjoy what you're doing you know don't worry about oh shoot man i got i got work later at like five today <laughs> like I can't, I can't even enjoy my day man or shoot Dang, I got that appointment I got to go to at 2 p.m. I can't even enjoy my day because I know I got to leave later. Don't think about that, bro. It's not 2 yet. It's 9 in the morning, bro. You got, like, how many hours? That's a good amount of time to just do whatever you want to do, man. You want to watch a TV show? Do that. Go back to sleep, sleep a little bit? Do that, you know what I'm saying? Or just anything. You got to just not think about it. And I'm not saying don't plan ahead, right? I'm not saying, hey, don't think about it. If you got work, don't go wash your uniform, you know? 
just let, let it sit there, man. And when it's too, then you can wash your uniform. Now, I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is stop thinking about it. Stop stressing about it, man. Like, damn, I don't want to go to work today because I know it's going to be, it's just going to be some BS at work. It's going to be tiring. It's going to be boring, man. I got mad work to do, too. It's one of those busy days, man. It's going to be bad. Don't think about that, man. Just chillax, you know? Like, you're not there yet. Just thank God that you have time to do you. And focus on, well, at least I have some time today to sit back, relax, you know, do me for a little bit. And yeah, I got to go into work later, but that's later. Right now, I'm going to just chill and vibe, you feel me? And I'm going to take my mind off of all the things that are bringing me my worries, you know. When that comes up, it's going to come up. But until then, enjoy what you're doing in the present. And maybe you're not even enjoying it, but still appreciate that time because, hey, um... It's taking your mind off of the worries and the stresses of your life. Just focus on what you're doing at the moment. Um, I know some people like to even say what they're doing in the moment. So if they're walking somewhere, they'll be like left, right, left, right, left, right. They'll say what's going on in the environment. They'll do all these things. Just take their mind off of what's really going on. And it's very helpful because it allows you to just recuperate and just forget about everything that's going on in your life only even even if it's just for like a little bit for a small moment you can't let it ruin your entire day because being overwhelmed isn't just oh i feel overwhelmed i'm worried i'm stressed it starts to affect your relationships your friendships your conversations your mood it affects your everything man it's not just as simple as hey I'm stressed out. I'm worried, especially if it's for a long period of time. And I, I personally experienced this and um, it sucks, honestly, especially as a person like being mean, like it is, I'm just <laughs> I don't know. There's no other way to put this, but being mean is just not something I like to do. I don't like to be mean to people. But what I notice is after being overwhelmed for a good little bit, I stopped caring as much about other people or like my responsibilities it starts to slip away from you and uh, that's why i think it's so important to take time to rest and take time to stop thinking about it because it really starts to get to you and it starts to affect you mentally um and it's bad for some people you don't want to stay in that mind space where you're always thinking about it and you're always overwhelmed and just thinking you know um you got to go you got to just stop you got to give yourself a chance to rest okay and um i think doing that will just help you tremendously help you a lot and um you'll benefit from it and the last piece of advice i can give you is don't stay in that negative mindset in that negative mind space don't say it don't stay where you're only thinking about how bad life is the bad things about life like you can't just always be thinking oh shoot life sucks because i have work today life sucks because i have bills coming up you know you got to focus on the good things in life and not just that but you got to surround yourself with good people good like a good environment watch what you know what your eyes take in what your ears take in you got to kind of pay attention to that if you're feeling negative and you're only surrounded by people who are just like who aren't good at good influences on you who make you mad provoke you not just just not good friends it's going to be a lot harder to forget about how bad that a day is because yeah people just trying to get at you man you gotta surround yourself with better pe uh better people excuse me <laughs> but you gotta do that and the same thing with your ears you can't just if you're feeling negative and you're blasting some negative sad music saying how how bad life is how sad life is how bad everything in life is life never gets better if you're always listening to that type of music how can you expect to think of anything good about life you, you won't you can't you know it's constantly in your ear wow life sucks life sucks life sucks you know you it doesn't man you're just going through a rough patch you know and although it may be bad right now it's um there's good on the other side of it you know there's a yin to every yin you know you gotta you just can't there's gotta be bad if you want the good to happen you know you gotta go down to come up uh i just got it's just how life is man and um it's just building your endurance so when you do finally come up um you won't ever have to worry about going down and ever feeling down to where you were because you know how to operate through that 
you know you can get through that you know what i'm saying uh it's just a test you got to just push through it and by the grace of god i know you guys are going to get through it whatever you're going through i don't know what you may be going through i don't know what you're fighting but i'm i'm praying for you bro i hope you're doing well uh i just hope that everything goes well for you i hope that you can just go through and just another day and like i said don't worry about getting through the whole day don't worry about it worry about getting through the next minute just focus on getting through now you feel me you can handle the rest of the day later just please focus on getting through the right now you feel me get through the right now and then you can worry about all the other struggles that may be going on in your life actually no you can't <laughs> focus on just getting through right now and then whatever comes up next don't focus on the things you can't control especially the things you can't control you can't control it man you can't control that friendship that relationship your work situation you can't always control these things you know they just happen that's just how life is you know so i just pray that you'll operate through it you won't stress about you know things out of your hand it's only in god's hand so i'm just praying that you guys will just get through it and that you're doing good i'm rooting for you and to anybody who may be wondering i'm doing fine i'm in a better mind space uh yes it's been a hard tough two weeks or not two weeks it's been a hard tough two months but i'm getting through it um and as hard as it's been i'm glad that i went through it because i know like i said uh if there ever is a next time i'm feeling like this um i know i'll be able to push through it i know that this is just like building my endurance my tolerance you know and i'll know especially when i come up i just know i know that eventually i'm going to be glad that i went through this and that i didn't stop trying that i kept going you know and oh, as exhausting as life is as overwhelming as it is i'm glad that i'm doing it because you know i know there's people counting on me i know there's there's people who care about me and know there's uh things i still want to do i still have you know a reason to keep going there's things i want to try and that may that might help you too you know try new things be excited about life try to find something to keep you going and that's well that's another thing a lot of people ask me why i continue to do youtube if life is so stressful if school's going on where's going on why can you why continue to just drop youtube videos consistently and just like try it's because youtube is my hobby i freaking love doing youtube bro if i'm being honest just sitting here in front of a camera you know have a microphone in hand just recording uh it's my passion i love to do it and that's what i mean you got to have that outlet and YouTube's one of the only things that are like keeping me going, bro. So you gotta find something to just have your back in that, and um, you'll succeed. And this is also a little documentary for myself. Um, I want to have something to look back on when I finally do come up, when my work does pay off, when I see the fruits of my labor. You know, I want to have something to look back on and say, "Wow, man, I'm glad that you went through with it." I'm glad that you didn't stop. I'm glad that you're still here, you know, because if no one else is going to bet on you, I'm betting on you and you should bet on you too. You shouldn't let people keep you down no matter what they say. People care about you. Whether you know it or not, people care about you. And you shouldn't go through life thinking that you're worthless because you're not. I think you're worth something and that should count. <laughs> I think every single last one of you are worth something. And, um... I hope that means something to you, you know, you're valuable and um, we care about you. We're glad you're here. But um, yeah, I really appreciate you guys for watching. Uh, I hope this helped. I hope that you learned something. I hope that if you didn't learn anything that you can at least, I at least took your mind off of life, you know, and uh, I'm glad I'm glad to be able to do that for you. I'm glad to be a, a help. That's what I want to be. You know, I want to help people out. So I'm glad I'm able to do that. And I really appreciate you. I also have this small playlist about or with songs that have helped me through this time. And um, I have a very unique music taste. I don't know. I haven't met a lot of people who like enjoy the same music as me. So take it with a grain of salt. But if you do like similar music to me, then maybe it'll help. And here it is. So thank you guys for watching. And uh, like I said, I'm rooting for you, man. Don't let life overwhelm you. <laughs> you're gonna get through it i promise man just hold through for a little bit longer <laughs> yeah one more thing one more thing man
That's a brand new day right there. So go make good of it.